Before I introduce uh, Ms. Carol Solomon, I just wanted to say a few things about people's health. Um, uh, I first had the opportunity to meet Ms. Carol Solomon in 2010 when I was running for the unexpired term of parish president. And a, a leasing agent who I had dealt with in private practice when I was a lawyer at One Shell Square had actually moved to Lakeway Center. And he called me uh, in the middle of the campaign and said that, heads up, People's Health is thinking about moving to New Orleans. So I didn't know Ms. Carol Solomon. I called her and said, look, I'd like to come meet with you. We met, we worked with JEDCO, uh, and, and bottom line is, People's Health, at that time, with 600 employees strong, decided to stay in Jefferson Parish. I think they made a great decision in that regard. I know, I know we're biased, but since then, they've grown to 850 employees. And not only are they a major um, employer in Jefferson Parish, not only a good company, uh, but they're a great corporate citizen because today, Carol and, and Donna stepped up to the plate when we had this issue with funding for our seniors and Meals on Wheels when there was a, a gap in funding. And they're going to be here to present a check today uh, to make sure that any senior who needs a meal gets one in Jefferson Parish. One of the things I really appreciate about Jefferson Parish is that when there's a problem, uh, they reach out to the businesses and people in their parish to see, you know, what we can do together to help solve the issue. And we were pleased to uh, to know that uh, that John Young would would come to us and tell us what the problem was, and and know that our concern for seniors uh, might put us in a position to help with this. Uh, hunger is a real issue for senior citizens. We see it every day as uh, we serve 55,000 uh, seniors in southeast Louisiana and certainly in Jefferson Parish. Uh, so we're, we're very happy uh, to be able to know that the over a thousand people a day that get meals from Meals on Wheels and that the 157 that were on a waiting list eligible but not sure that they would be able to get into the program will be able to get these meals served to them every day uh, you know it's it's a substantial uh, cost yes but but the out uh, the difference in the quality of life and the outcomes for for people that can are in fixed incomes that can be sure to get nutritional meals every day delivered to them is, is a, the outcome we're all looking for. We're really happy to be here today, excited about the opportunity to work with Jefferson Parish and especially the Meals on Wheels program that has such a positive effect for the seniors in our parish and in southeast Louisiana. So we're here today to make a donation to the program so that it can be funded, fully funded, through 2014 and we can eliminate the waiting list of seniors to be eligible to get uh, their Meals on Wheels. It's important for healthy lifestyles for people to get the proper nutrition and to have healthy balanced meals on a regular basis and unfortunately there are so many seniors, uh, tens of thousands of seniors in southeast Louisiana that don't have access to the proper nutrition and regular meals and this wonderful organization does a tremendous job of outreach to making sure that seniors get the meals they need and are able to uh, help with their nutrition and their overall health. Why is this donation important to the local Meals on Wheels program? It fits in perfectly with our mission and also that of people's health because the Jefferson Council on Aging is here to assist seniors in being independent in the environment of their choice. And of course, one of the most important things is that they eat nutritional meals, and this provides the funds for them to do that. We deliver meals to people who are uh, 60 years or older, who are either seniors or also adult disabled. And most of the people we deliver to, I think the average age is about 82 years. And the people do not have a support system. The majority of the meals go to people who do not have a support system where there isn't someone who could prepare a meal for them. So it's crucial and that's how to keep these people healthy so that they can maintain their independence. And that's our mission. People's Health Network is a Medicare Advantage plan and uh, with people that are eligible for Medicare, whether they be over 65 or disabled and are eligible to join the program, we have all of the Medicare benefits, but many other benefits beyond that that helps people maintain a healthy lifestyle 
and uh, we do a lot of outreach to members to see beyond the typical doctor visits and hospitalizations what can we do to educate members on how to keep themselves healthy and active in the community and just to prove health care outcomes. We're just grateful to people's health for the donation and I think their mission and our mission are a perfect match and this is a great thing that they have done for the community. We had over 200 people on the waiting list and we have already just about eliminated the waiting list so we have 200 people in Jefferson Parish who are eating daily meals today. If people want more information about People's Health we welcome them to come to our website on peopleshealth.com. They could call the Jefferson Council on Aging it's 888-5880 or they could go to our website, which is jcoa.net, and they could sign up for our programs on the website.